do I do I prefer this one to the Barbie extra? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Erica, where all dolls are looking fabulous. Today, I'm going to show you a new doll that's been going on since last year. And uh, since I've seen this doll posted on Instagram with some people and doing reviews on YouTube as well, I was just so curious and I would like to see for myself how the doll looks like and if it's really, really a good quality. So the doll that we're going to unbox today is a... It's called a Defa Lucy doll. So I have one here that I bought from Timu. So I just recently um, joined the Timu, you know, and uh, it was actually a very good deal. So I have this doll with a huge discount. So I don't know if that's the regular price or they're just giving me a huge discount so that I can, um, so that, I'll be attracted to buy some more because they're giving me so many deals like offering um, big discounts, giving me coupons and so much stuff going on. They keep on texting me, but the reason why I joined it because of this doll. So the box is actually a very um, similar to Barbie Extra or other fashion dolls that we've seen. As you can see here, there's a picture of the doll and then it says Defa Lucy. So the company called is Defa. It says here at the back, there's a logo here. So I presume that that's the company name. And then the side of the box is just a picture of her. And then here again, it says mix and match. And then the back is the other dolls in this collection, which is this one and this one. But I chose her because I think she is the most beautiful in this collection. Many people says that this is like a rip off a Barbie extra. I know what people think about it because there's some similarities, but to be fair, um, it's just my opinion, okay? Maybe the quality is going to be much lesser than Barbie Extra. So anyway, so that's it. And now let's take her out of the box and let's see what she looks like. Lucy is out of the box. And first impression, I like her. She's gorgeous. The hair quality is very soft. It is not... um the best quality of hair that we normally get, you know, I think this is nylon. I don't know if it's nylon or um, propylene, something like that. <laughs> I forgot, don't know how to say it, but I think it's nylon, the one that we always have for Rainbow High dolls, but it's very soft, okay? It's very shiny. So I really like it so far. But, you know, with nylon type of hair, um, in time, it's going to be um, brittle and it's going to be damaged very easily. But obviously, it depends how you play with your doll. But anyway, so the doll is out and she is so cute with her outfit. I am so in love with the top, with her shorts, the belt, and this piece of fabric here, which is very soft. I think it's kind of chiffon fabric. But yeah, it's very, very beautiful. Okay, so now we're going to take a closer look at her face because she's got a very beautiful face, as you can see. By the way, she's wearing a hat or a cup that is actually attached on her head. We can actually take it off probably or just leave it on for a minute. But she's got a fringe, as you can see here. But her face is very beautiful. Um... It's similar to some other fashion dolls that I've seen before, which is, I'm not going to say the company because I don't want to be, um, you know, sued or something. <laughs> but there's something about it that it reminds me of her face. Um, the closed mouth is very beautiful. I like the color lipstick. She's got blue eyes. And then she's got this pair of earrings, which is made of plastic. There's nothing special in it. I don't know what kind of earring is this. But it's beautiful. And then she's got this pink cup that is hard plastic, but it's beautifully molded, as you can see. And it's really sitting on her head perfectly. I think if I can take it off, that's... Okay. Oh, okay. So it's, it can still go back in a normal shape, which is good. 
I think. Yes, it does. The shorts is separate, obviously, from the top, as you can see. But it comes with the belt that is already attached to the short with some buckles in it. And it has this piece of fabric that is, I think it's kind of chiffon fabric type of material. That is, is beautiful, okay? It's giving me um runway look, something. But she's got this beautiful top, which is a very shiny. It comes with so many glitters. And it it's actually got some rhinestones in it and then it has this mesh type of sleeves that's attached to her t-shirt the pattern is um goes all the way at the back which is good obviously it is closed by velcro um but i really like the type of the fabric that they use in this it feels like cotton it's very soft and then she is wearing a purse or a bag that is like similar to a coach bag. <laughs> yeah, but it's made of very hard plastic, but it got some mold in there as well. As you can see, it's very hard. So yeah, the shoes is cute. I really like it. Although I wish that she's got a pointed heel because she's got a flat heel. So that's a no-no. I like my dolls with a pointed heel so that they can still wear um high-heeled shoes. But this one, obviously, she can only wear a flat shoes. Yeah, but the details of the shoes, guys, is very beautiful. Look at that. Must be a Converse or Adidas. Adidas or Nike. Not sure, but I like the color. So... Okay, so that's her. I think she's beautiful. So my opinion, I think the Barbie Extra is still much better. Obviously, the quality of the Barbie Extra is like you cannot compete um, with this kind of doll. Look at this. Okay, so the doll that I have here was sale. She was on sale in Amazon. I got her for only twenty pounds, and she's got this marvelous, very beautiful. Um, long hair and the quality of the clothes is much much better she's got articulation oh by the way the articulation of this doll obviously we have to talk about it as well so she's got articulation on her knee on her elbow and on her wrist now um she's got a belly button bandy which is okay the type of plastic that they use is kind of similar to the Barbie Extra. But the Barbie Extra is heavier. Obviously, she's got long hair. But, yeah, I think this is much hallowed plastic. So, yeah. Um, What else? She can move her head, tilt like that. So, which is good. Um, It's very limited. But it's still okay. So, my opinion. Do I... Do I prefer this one to the Barbie Extra? I prefer the Barbie Extra now um, for the new company though. I just want to try this one because this one has a nylon hair and I don't like nylon hair. At least Barbie Extra, they use good quality of hair and um, this one is Saran. She's got a nice Saran hair. So yeah. And um, although some may face mold of the Barbie Extra, I'm very tired of looking at it. And I just, I don't know. But the face of this doll is much better compared to this one. But there's some things that, you know, like you cannot, that the Barbie Extra is much, much better. And she cannot compete with that. The Defa Lucy. Yeah, so this is my review for the new doll called Defa Lucy. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave, please leave a comment down below. What do you think of this doll? Um... Do you agree with me or not? Just leave a comment as well. If you like this doll, please tell me what do you like about this doll. And please like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on my Instagram, which is a fashion fairy tale 21 So that you can see the other pictures of my Barbie collection. So, okay. So, guys, thank you so much. And until next time. Bye.